Hi everyone, my name is Miriam and I'm going to be leading a dance for Parkinson's class. So to start out, um, sit halfway in between the back of the chair and the edge of the chair if you can. And place your feet directly underneath your knees so you want a nice 90 degree angle. And throughout this class, I like to use the image of a tree to represent our posture. So if you can take a moment to imagine that your feet are tree roots that are rooted into the ground. And that connection between your feet and the floor helps you find some stability um, and have a nice strong trunk, which represents the tree trunk, so that your arms and legs, the limbs, are free to move. So you want to think about holding a nice tall posture, sitting halfway in between the edge and the back of the chair, and always trying to feel that connection to your feet on the ground. If it's more comfortable, you're welcome to wear shoes, or you're welcome to take your shoes off. Socks or barefoot is also fine. So to start out, we're gonna rub the hands together to generate some heat. to move into our sun salutation, um, which this is based on the Mark Morris Dance for PD class model. So this is how we begin to connect our breath, our movement, and warm up our upper body and torso. We start by scooping our arms down, inhaling, and on the exhale, pressing the hands down through the center. We press our hands back up. Gather the light and sink it down. One hand open. The other hand open. And we dive. Do that again. Scoop the arms down. Press the hand. the other hands, keep open, and open. Now let's move into our sun salutation, um, which this is based on the Mark Morris Dance for PD class model. So this is how we begin to connect our breath, our movement, and warm up our upper body and torso. We start by scooping our arms down, inhaling, and on the exhale, pressing the hands down through the center. Press your hands back up. Gather the light. Down. 
see the other hand. Circling the torso. You can hold on to the chairs and more stable if you like. Tucking the chin, we we'll roll down the spine. Pressing into the thighs, we scoop our head up and reverse. Slowly circling the head, looking at each corner and surface of the room, trying to notice details. This next exercise is called Seaweed. And this was inspired by my experience with nature and water, which I find very relaxing. So in this exercise, we're going to start by trying to move each individual finger. Just practice moving each finger. Do that twice more. Keeping the fingertips together, we slowly start to move the palms away from each other. You can imagine that your hands are like a small jellyfish. side to side. Take 
taking a deep inhale. We think of lengthening our spine and we slowly start to twist. So one leg comes in front, the other stays behind, and I'm trying to reach behind me and twist. Arm opens up, and we twist to the other side. Nice deep inhale. On the exhale, twist. Now that our upper body and torso is a little more warmed up, we're going to move on to the feet. So we're going to start by lifting each heel. And you can also feel free to modify this to just do the arms if you're not comfortable moving your feet. So we'll start by lifting one heel up and down, the other heel up, down. Now the toes, lift your toes up. Now we'll walk the ankle out. Drop the heel back in. Drop the heel. Other side. Part of the warm up for dance practices class. 